super excited that you joined us today. My yes. name is Miss Rachel. And my name is Miss Kay, and we want to welcome you to our preschool experience. Yes, we're so excited for you to be here. Our theme for this month is this or that. So everybody say that with me. Say this, this or that. that. And Miss Kay, what is our Bible verse for this month? Our Bible verse is God knows everything. 1 John 3, 20. Oh, that was awesome. I think we should do it one more time. Yes. Okay. God, God knows, knows everything. First John, John 3, 20. 20. Oh, that was awesome. Now I'm ready for today. I'm so ready. You know what I'm really, really ready for? What are you ready for? I'm ready for praise and worship. Praise and worship. Praise and worship. Praise and worship. Father Abraham, have any sons? 
What's up, y'all? Welcome to our story time. I'm Mr. John. And I'm Miss Alexis. And check this out. So last week, we packed our things to get ready to go on our trip. Mm -hmm. This week, we're going to play a game, and we're going to make some decisions on if we want to go to this place or that place. Y'all want to do it with me? Say, this This place place or or that that place. place. All right. Are y'all ready to play? You ready to play, Alexis? I'm ready to play. Let's do it. Let's see. So the first one is, would you rather go to the beach or to the zoo? Mm. Mm. What are y'all thinking out there? I think I know what I would rather do. <laughs> what? What, I, Mr. John? I think I would rather go to the beach. Oh. I love yeah. water, man. I love water. I don't too much care for the sand part, mm-hmm. but I love the water. So I think I had to go to the beach. I had to go to okay. the beach. What about Me you? Too. Me too. I would rather go to the beach too. You want to the beach? Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. yeah, yeah. Would you ever go surfing? Oh, yeah, for sure. Oh, yeah. Adventurous Alexis. That's what I'm talking about. Okay, here's the next one. Here we go. The next one. Next one. Would you rather go to the ocean? Or outer space. Ooh, that's a good one. That's Mr. a really John, good one. I think I would go to outer space. Outer space? Definitely. Yes. Oh, well, because there's like no, there's no gravity yeah. and yeah. you can. I could be floating, floating. Like an astronaut? Yep, yeah, yep, like yep, an yep, astronaut. Yep, yep, yep. Go on the moon? Yeah. Well, I think I would rather go to the ocean. Again, I love the water, guys. I love the water. And the, got the fishes. You got Dory and Nemo in there. It's all kind of fun things in the ocean. I think I'd rather go into the ocean. Yeah. Yeah, what about you? Oh, you already said what you Here you go. Next one, guys. Next one, next one, next one. Would you rather go to Disneyland oh. or Legoland? Disneyland. Disneyland. That wasn't even a, no. Wow, that was quick. You chose yeah. really fast on that one. What about you guys? Disneyland. Yeah. I think I, think I would actually rather go to Legoland. You I like to be creative. Like last month, remember last month it was creativity? Uh-huh. I would like to be, I like, I'd rather be creative. I'd rather okay. be creative. Now, now, here's the cool thing. The cool thing is this. So in our story today, there's a guy who also had to choose where he wanted to go. And his options were God's way or his own way. And his name was Jonah. So Jonah was hanging out. He was a prophet of God and all this kind of stuff, right? And God told Jonah to go to a place called Nineveh Mm -hmm. to preach to the Ninevites and get them to repent of their sins. And Jonah was like, God, mm, 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 I ain't going to do it. So guess what he did and said? What, what? He ran. He mm. ran from God. He ran and he ran and he ran and he went to this place. He tried to go to this place called Tarshish. Oh. Yeah, tried to go to this place called Tarshish. So he gets on this boat, right? Mm-hmm. He gets on this boat and he's trying to run from God and be disobedient and do things his own way. And guess what happens? Storm comes. This crazy storm comes. Crazy storm comes. And, and, and Jonah ends up getting thrown off the ship. The people in the ship throw him off the ship because they realized that he was the reason the storm was there because mm-hmm. God was trying to get Jonah's attention to get him to go his way and not Jonah's way. So then guess what happens after he gets thrown off the ship? What happened? He gets swallowed by a big old fish. Mm. And he's inside this fish for three days and three nights. And this fish is so big that Jonah's in there and he's praying. And he's like, all right, God, check this out, God. I'm going to stop going my own way, and I'm going to do it your way, God. I'm going to do it your way. And so then the fish spits him out onto dry ground, and he decides that he's going to go to Nineveh like God told him to do. He goes to Nineveh, right? He goes to Nineveh, and he preaches to the Ninevites, and guess what the Ninevites do? What do they do? They decide that they want to stop doing things their own way, and they want to do it God's way as well. Well, and here's the thing. So it takes us to our bottom line of God knowing what's best. See, if Jonah had just listened from the very beginning, Mm -hmm. he wouldn't have ended up in this storm and he wouldn't have been in the belly of the fish. He would have just went to Nineveh and helped these good people out to where they could know God, just like you and I do and just like our friends at home do. And if they just did what he said, he would have learned and realized that God knows what's best best. Isn't that a crazy story? That is that is a crazy story. Yeah, yeah. I don't want to end up in a big fish's mouth. Oh, no. Yeah, mm. not at all. Not at all. Not at all. It stink. Oh, my goodness. It yeah, I bet, I bet fish got bad breath. Mm-mm. Mm-mm-mm. Yeah, but hey, stay away from bad breath by being obedient to God. God yes. Think we should pray out. What you think? Yes, we should. Right hand up. Left hand up. Bring them together, and let's pray. God, 
Help us to desire your way more than our own way. Help us to make good decisions and guide us in the way that is best because we know that you know what's best for us. In Jesus' name I pray. Amen. Amen. Well, that's it for story time, Alexis. That's it. Let's say bye to our friends. Bye. See you guys later. We'll see y'all next week. Peace. Wow. That was an amazing story. Amazing. Oh, my goodness. That was so amazing. What was our bottom line for the story? Our bottom line was that God knows what's best for me. That is so cool. So we should always do what God says because he yes. knows what's best. That is cool. I really, really like that. And parents, we got something for you too. It is our parent Facebook group. We want you to subscribe to that so you can keep up to date with what's going on here in Kidsmen. Yes. And we look forward to seeing all of you and your kiddos next week. All righty. See you then. Bye. Bye.